I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Soccer is the most viewed sport in Spain. 43% of the world's olive oil production is done in Spain. Spaniards celebrate the new year by eating each grape after each spell strike. Spain has more than 8,000 beaches. Mexico just elected a new president. His name is Enrique Peña Nieto. The first printing press in North America was used in Mexico in 1539. Mexicans are working the longest average hours in the world. Good morning, Freedom High School students and staff. I'm Sydney. And I'm Kristen. Welcome to the Freedom Forum's daily newscast. Today is Monday, October 1st, 2018. <coughs> it is a day six. So Kristen, how's our weather looking today? Well, Sydney, it finally looks like the sun will shine today. They're, they're forecasting a high of 78. Great, Kristen. We could all do with some sunshine. Now let's get back to our announcements. Students and parents, make sure you download that BASD app. You will stay updated on district and school information. Attention sophomores and juniors, the PSAT test will be given at Freedom on Saturday, October 13th, 2018 at 7.45 a.m. The cost of the test is $25. A check or money order made payable to Freedom High School should be dropped off at Office 207. Deadline is tomorrow. The library is now open for after-school tutoring and homework assistance Mondays through Thursdays, 2.30 to 4. Hackysack Club meets today in room 2.30. New members are welcome to hop in. You love Broadway musicals. Are you obsessed with shows like Dear Evan Hansen? Well, Freedom is starting its very own Broadway musical club. Join us on Tuesday, October 2nd in room 601 from 2.30 to 3.30 p.m. to help form this new club. All are welcome. The first NAACP meeting take will take place on Thursday, October 4th, after school in room 105. The first art club meeting will be October 3rd in room 201. Attention all travelers, Travel Club finalized its plans for New York City on Saturday, November 3rd. Take a ferry past the Statue of Liberty, visit Ellis Island, and tour the 9-11 Museum. Space is limited. Stop by room 224 to sign up with Miss Buchanan. Be sure to bring money for your spot. Next meeting is day October 3rd. Attention juniors and seniors, invitations to apply for membership in the National Honor Society has been sent to the BASD email accounts of eligible students. If you did not receive an invitation to apply but think you should have, please see Dr. Kruger in room 120 ASAP. The deadline for completed applications is Wednesday, October 17th at 3.30 at 3 o'clock p.m. Are you interested in VOTEC but not sure what they have to offer you? Attend an open house at Votech on Wednesday, October 24th from 6.30 to 8.30, where you can check out our 30 or more programs, meet the instructors, and visit their program display tables. Refreshments will be available. Do not miss out on this opportunity. So, Kristen, what's up with sports today? Varsity Volleyball will be away at Pleasant Valley at 5.30 tonight. Girls Varsity Soccer is home tonight at 7 against Deeruff. The boys soccer team will be away tonight at Deeruff. Varsity Field Hockey's game against Liberty happens tonight at the Liberty Field. Come cheer on the team at 6. Freedom Football plays Easton this Friday away. Make plans to come out and support the team. That's all for today, Freedom. Thank you for tuning into our daily newscast. I'm Kristen. And I'm Sydney, reporting for the Freedom Forum, a voice for the voiceless since 1967.